YouTube, hey Facebook, hey Steemit, how is everybody out there guys? Alright, I'm going to try to make this video fast because I did my Spanish video, it took about 8 to 9 minutes, so I'm going to try to make this video fast, I don't want my memory to end, I don't have no memory, I need to buy another memory, I need to make, I need to have more memory because, you know, I'll be doing videos and stuff like that. Anyways guys, uh, on the past videos I was talking about in uh, three main ways, three main ways to increase your revenue if you have a, a physical business or a virtual business okay so yesterday we talked about the first one that is uh obvious it, it's obvious you know one of the the three main ways is increase the number of your customers i did went in detail i did give a couple examples so you guys you know those examples might actually work for you you know it, who knows anyways today we're going to talk about the second main reason okay so is uh, increase the average of the transaction price okay increase the average of the transaction price that is the second one okay and i'm going to give you a couple of examples so you guys could like think about what kind of you, you're gonna you're gonna think about what kind of business you have because everybody has a different business so i hope these samples that i'm going to give you will help you to find and how to increase your average of your transaction price. Okay, I'm gonna give you the first example, which is real easy, McDonald's, Burger King, Jack in the Box, okay? Any fast food uh, restaurant, what happens? When you go in, you add, you ask for the number one or number two uh, in, in the menu, what happens? You get the burger, you get the fries, and you get the drink, okay? What's the second thing that happens, okay? The person that's selling you, the person that, you know, is helping you out on the cash register, what or he, what she or he says would you like to upgrade okay would you like to upgrade that makes a difference guys what happens there okay the average of the of the average of the transaction price actually went up you know a couple of cents but it went up guys okay so that's one of the things i'm actually you know um uh, uh those are the examples i want you to to get okay how can you increment something how can you add something uh, if you if you have a restaurant what can you do to you know, upsize your nachos or upsize your hamburger, or, or would you like to uh, have two hamburgers? You know, two meat patties or something. You know, how can you uh, average your trans? How can you increase your average of your transaction price? I'll give you another example. Uh, if you go to the grocery stores, what happens? If, when you're in the grocery stores, uh, whenever you're about to pay, whenever you're about to pay, what happens? When you're in line, there's candy bars, there's uh, gum. There's pops. There, there's a lot of stuff on the side. Why? Because people are waiting. Okay. Let's just say you're waiting there and your, your transaction price is $10. Just for having them right there, people be like, man, oh, that Milky Way looks good. Oh, that Three Musketeers looks awesome. Oh, I need some gum. I need some gum. I'm going to go talk to my one of my friends, so I need some gum. Stuff like that. So anyways, what happens? That person grabs the gum grabs the Reese's cup, he adds it to the average price. What happens there, okay? So the average transaction price just rose. So instead of him wasting $10, now he's wasting $11 with 50 cents. That's a $1.50 increase, okay? That's another example. Another example, which this one might help a lot of you guys, okay? Uh, for example, uh, sell a product that you could, uh, I don't know, I don't wanna, I don't wanna, you know, uh, I'm gonna just say it the way I, I say it because I was trying to say it a different way, you know, a little bit more professional way, but I'm gonna say the way I know it. For example, uh, I used to work at, a, at, at um, I used to work at a clothes store back in the States, back in Houston, Texas, and it was actually, it was the mall. So anyways, in the mall, they sell this shirt, okay, they sell this shirt, what it, it, it had a snake. It had like a head of a snake here, okay? So that snake goes around and you have to buy the, the you have to buy the pants if you want to finish the snake. You know, if you want the snake to have his head, his tail and his head and everything. So you can't buy the pants by itself. OK, let's just say you go to the store and uh, you want to buy a, a, a shirt. OK, and then you want to buy a shirt. And then what happens? The person is like, oh, you know what? I have the perfect pants that go with that shirt. Okay, so he's trying to increase the average transaction price. So he's like, would you like to see it with no extra charge? I mean, would, uh, would you like to see it, you know, with, uh, with, you know, with, you know, he's not going to charge you to see it. I, I don't know how you say that word. Uh, would you like to see it with no, with no charge? You know, would you like to see it? So anyways, he's going to show you the pants and you're going to see that it matches, you know? 
So you're gonna want the pants, or you're gonna want the hat that goes with the shirt, or you're gonna want the socks that goes with the with the, with the shoes. You know, you know what I mean, okay? But let me finish the story about where I used to work at the at the uh, the um, clothes store. Anyways, that shirt you have to buy the pants if you want to match. You can't buy the pants by itself. You have to buy the shirt. And then after that, there are some boots, Timberland boots that go with that. You know. So right there, guys, right there, you increase the average transaction price. All right. Sorry about the noise in the background. Hope you guys can hear me well. So anyways, guys, uh, those are three examples. I hope I, that helped. Okay. So uh, on this video and how to increase the average transaction price. Okay. Uh, I gave a couple examples. I don't want to give too many because uh, I don't want to make this video too long. But if you guys have any questions, go ahead and leave a comment down below. If this video was helpful, hit, hit the like button. If you're on YouTube and you're not subscribed yet, go ahead and subscribe so you won't miss out no more of these videos. Hit that like button in YouTube. If you're interested, it, upvote and follow. That's going to be it, guys. Have a good one. Have a great one. Good night and stay safe and blessed to everybody. I only have one thing to say, guys. Start today with your amigo, Pedro Ramirez. Gotta go. Adios.